Assalamu alaikum friends, today I would like to discuss a very very amazing short trick here regarding the problem given in the previous year here. You can just see the general method which is given in the solution. Uh, I think this is the general solution but uh, uh, I would like to discuss inshallah uh, the solution given by me which will help you to save a lot of time. You can do the problem in just fraction of seconds and it will be amazing and it's very interesting also. So uh, when a block is dropped from this position A, it will reach this position B at this place here. You know, this is from A and this is the second position let us imagine. At this second position if you observe, what are you going to see here? You can see that velocity because of uh, vertical circle uh, is given as root of 5 G R. Okay, root of 5 G capital R. But as it is dropped from certain height here, we can also consider the velocity as square root of 2 g h because height is considered as h in this diagram here. Okay, so as from here it is skidding down, the velocity is taken as root of 2 g h. So uh, these two velocities will be almost same, exactly same you can say. So you can write here, it's very simple, that is so you can write just write 5 g r and the root is nothing but root of 2 g h. Squaring on both sides will be getting cancelled root and root. You can cancel out even g and g also. And you can write here now h is equal to 5 by 2 r. But he's asking us to write the form uh, answer in terms of diameter. That's it. Then you can write here h is nothing but 5 by 2 and diameter is I mean radius is nothing but half of the diameter that is d by 2. So which can be taken as 5d by 4. So therefore your answer is 5d by 4 which is the fourth option. Hope you have enjoyed this. Thank you very much.